Well, hey everyone, it's Hudson, and I'm gonna answer a quick, simple question that I get a lot from people watching the Approaching the Scene series or people signing up for my free office hours that we're doing through the pandemic, these interactive office hours where people submit questions Tuesday mornings, 10 a.m. So uh, it's about which level should matter when I'm setting up to take photos on particularly people that have adopted my pan and tilt system. I've got one on my legs, I've got one on my leveling adapter, I've got one under my pan and tilt head, I've got one on my nodal slide if I'm using one, I've got one on the camera and I'm just gonna simplify it, dumb it down, it's the one on the head that matters. I'll get everything set up how I'm gonna shoot, I tilt the head forward, I look straight down, loosen my leveling adapter, get that bubble level dead center, lock it, and I'm level, I'm ready to go. And then if I wanna make sure that the camera is level from a tilt perspective, I'll use the, the level view on my, on my live view, either through the viewfinder or on the back screen of my camera, and make sure that that's level if I need that. But anything I do with the pan and tilt is gonna stay level as long as that head is level. That's the critical bit. And if you're worried about the other levels not perfectly lining up, well, there's machine tolerances. It's all gonna be very, very close. So thanks for the questions. Keep those flowing to me. You can email me. You can hit me in the comments section. You can sign up for the office hours. Thanks so much. We'll see you next time.